A sponge is a member of the phylum Periphera. It is a simple animal with many cells, but no mouth, muscles, heart, or brain. It is sessile, meaning it cannot move from one place to another the way most animals can. A sponge is an animal that grows in one spot like most plants do. Nevertheless, sponges are quite successful. The basic body plan is a jelly-like layer sandwiched between two thin layers of cells. Their bodies full of pores and channels allowing water to circulate through them. Most of them feed on bacteria and other microorganisms. A few of them eat tiny crustaceans. There are no more than 10,000 species of sponge. Most sponge live in the ocean. A few live in fresh water. All sponges take in water through pores in their bodies. The water goes out through a big tube in the center. Most sponges take little bits of food from the water going through their bodies. Animals that get food this way are called filter feeders. What makes them different? Sponges are simple animals. A few things make them different from other animals. A living sponge can change the shape of its body. Most cells in its body can move around. A few cells can even change from one type of cell to another. Like jellyfish and all other known metazoans, sponge bodies are made of non-living jelly-like mass sandwiched between two main layers of cells. Sponges also have no nervous system. Their middle-like jelly layers have many different types of cells. Some types of cells in their outer layers may move into the middle layer and change their function. There are four classes of sponges. The difference between these kinds is in how their skeleton is made. Demosponges is a class that contains most of the sponges. The sponges in this class make their skeleton from spongin. Spongin is a special protein. All the large sponges are in this order. Bony sponges use calcium carbonate to make the skeleton. They are known as calceria. They are usually very small, only 3 to 4 inches in height. Of the about 15,000 sponges known, about 400 are calcera. Glass sponges use silicone dioxide to make their skeletons. They are sometimes called hexantillide. Most of these live very deep in the ocean. There are about 500 different kinds of glass sponges in 17 different families. These sponges make for about 7% of all known living sponges.